That looks crazy, huh? It is Friday morning, 10.15. I was about to say afternoon, but it's technically still morning. Friday morning, I said that, I said that, what the hell? And we are on our way to go take Vicente to his mom's house. My mom's taking Angelica to the airport. Heli's leaving towards Texas. She's gonna be gone for three years. We're gonna have to visit her if we wanna see her. She's gonna try to come on holidays. But the truth of the matter is, that has happened. That is now here. And she's gonna be boarding a plane in the next, she might be already boarded. 10.30 I think is her flight time, so you know how that goes. I don't know how it goes, but you might know how it goes when you're flying. I'm on my way to work. Yeah, I have to be there in about 45 minutes. I should be there by about 11. And I planned that if I left at 10.15, I should be able to make it and still get coffee. So I hope all of that is gonna happen. So I'm, so I'm driving by, and you see that sign right there that's lit? I think there's also one behind me. If you can see it right there, that's lit. And then all of a sudden there's this one right here that is not lit. I am showing you it is just like a piece of paper. And you know what happened right now? Let me tell you what happened. Let me explain to you what happened. Just give me a second. So what happens is that I start pumping gas and I trip out. I'm like, what the heck? It's 10 cents more. I was like, that doesn't seem right. Well, what happens? Of course, as I'm driving, the only sign that I can see is the one that's lit that gets me to here. I start pumping gas and then that's when I notice that the it starts pumping at um, 10 cents more. And then the guy, I go in to tell the guy, I was like, hey, you guys are uh, pumping gas at a, a different advertised price. And he's all like, oh, well, there's a sign right there. It's not lit. Um, I know that it's not lit. I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but um, that one says the credit card is 10 cents more. Get out of here is that okay is that all right i mean he has it advertised but where where i could see it no where i pulled in the reason why i pulled in no shady shady yo what's up everybody good evening good evening and i really wanted to touch base on what it is that me and vicente selected as shoes i know that we kind of showed you and we kind of didn't but that's exactly what we got of course we stuck to our favorite, well, let's see if it'll zoom back on me, give me the light, there you go. I definitely had to go with the Adidas because that's what daddy rocks. Daddy rocks Adidas, Ortheo Light, especially for the kids, a lot softer sole. Jordans are just too stiff and hard, especially for kids. I, anybody who rocks Jordan, that's what's up. I used to put Jordans on my son, but then he started to not like them as much as he liked his other shoes adidas nikes in general um but i'm talking about softer nikes like the what did they have they don't have the 5.0s for the kids what are they oh they're not free runs are they the roshis remember the roshis my son loved to rock those and then he had the choice between his jordans and his roshis he would pick his roshis and then he had the choice between his adidas and his roshis and he would pick his adidas and i don't know um, if I have a lot of influence in it because I get to decide but you see I give him the opportunity So he was walking around with um, the red pair of EQTs, right? But he couldn't get the EQTs remember he had another pair But I want I've been wanting to find those red tubulars um, For him because he loves those shoes. I don't know why and when I seen him He's like got all excited and yeah, I didn't record a lot of the voice action that was happening or a lot of little different scenes that he that he went through at that moment let's look at it they are the xplrs which to me would mean they're like the xr in general one their version or their style of shoe that would be most similar to the xr ones that i have and they do definitely have that same st well let me show you what am i talking about that, my friends, is the shoe that we're talking about. Ooh, look at that. I'm gonna have to keep focusing. These things are nice though. And I could switch the shoelaces if I'd like to, but check this out, that's what I like. That that's blue. It looks really cool when 
you kind of just look at it like this. Let me see if I can focus it like that. There you go. That looks dope, right? And you know I got them a couple new fits. I got them some pants, stuff that I didn't show you. But the, Levi makes this new style of 5'11". I don't know if you guys have seen them. But they're called 5'11 Performance Dry Moisture Stretch Pants for Kids. Like these things are amazing. Amazing. Just like the feel of them. The, the texture. Like it's like I feel that he's going to enjoy wearing them. And so I bought them. We don't have any more at my work, otherwise I would have bought those. But I bought, put those away. I bought black and I bought gray and I'm about to go buy any more that I see at my store so that he could have probably like 10 pairs. Is that ridiculous that I get him 10 pairs? Probably not, right? That's like a hundred bucks of pants, $10 a pop. Not really, because he flies through them. And you guys see, I have I have like a bunch of different joggers, and you're probably like, damn, Vicente always puts the same red, blue, and tan joggers all the time. But the truth, I have like three pairs of each. You wanna know why? Because Vicente, as soon as he has an opportunity to, he'll like lay out like on his knees with his tablet, anywhere, and just like play games, and like and then if he's with Sophia, forget it, they'll just sit wherever. They're like, my brother says that they're like hippies, and no offense to hippies, but, they find comfort in any environment situation and they're going to place themselves in a position to feel comfortable and just have fun like little kids would right so i hope you guys enjoyed yourself i know that this was just a quick update on what it was that we ended up selecting for him as shoes because i didn't actually um show you guys in the vlog i just kind of just walked out and be sent this carry in the bag so i didn't get to go through and show you guys oh yeah these are the ones because i remember when i did my triple my triple blacks my xr ones whatever other shoes that i think that i've the, the tubulars i would always show you guys what it was that we ended up selecting you guys would know but in this vlog for whatever reason i didn't kind of do that i just showed you that he was trying on shoes and then i realized that we're walking out of the store and i have no footage of what shoes we actually got so i wanted to update you guys and give you guys that little tidbit I don't know why I did that. Let's take that out. You know what? I just wanted to say good flipping night.